friends, welcome to my video, my channel. And I have an exciting Natalie Attired Celebration collection again. So if you are not familiar with what the Celebration collection is, I actually have my last video I will put up in a card. I never know which side it's on. So a card somewhere. And it's basically, so you can see the last one, which was really awesome, which is why I ordered another one immediately, basically for $57 plus $10 shipping they send you to three or four items that are actually yours to keep. So that is an amazing deal. And they do give you the opportunity, if you decide not worth the money or there's enough pieces in here that you don't like, you can send back the entire collection only and get your $57 back. What you don't get back is the $10 shipping to you and then the shipping back. Fail. That's worth it for such a great deal. Absolutely loved my last collection. Now, Natalie Attired is one that I haven't gotten a lot of I've only gotten like one box from them because they did they listed as like two to something and I'm actually size zero so I've been concerned about whether they're gonna have my size or not in the last box they did so that's why I felt comfortable going ahead and ordering another one so we'll see with this one if they still have enough that's my size but I was just really I keep looking down at it it's here so I'm excited to see what's in here. Another announcement for you all. Uh, my first single with my band is coming out on Friday. Friday at noon, we are posting the music video. Super, super excited. I think I'm gonna have a Stitch Fix video that comes out at the same time and I'll put the little commercial in it at the time. But here's a link to the YouTube channel for my band if you are interested in watching. If not, totally understandable because you might be all about the fashion. That's most likely why you're here. You don't care about the music, which is totally understandable. But some of you have expressed interest. So there is a link to my channel. And all right, let's get into this, see what they have. Okay, they do give you kind of an invoice of what's in there, what it's worth. Last time it was like $150 worth of stuff that I got for the $67 when you include shipping. So I'll go over that at the end, but right now let's just get into the pieces. So this is by Always and Forever. And this is a small, not an extra small. It's a flannel with, I don't know what color is that? Kind of a pinkish, peachish color in it. Maybe it's a coral. And three quarter sleeves. You know, it's got a tab there. So, and this, the V-neck here, so it's not a complete button-up, but I think that's cute. I like that it's a three-quarter sleeve. It gives me more of a uh, spring fallish vibe, you know, when it's not super cold out. So, okay, I like that. Next up, it appears that we have a twofer, so I like it when they kind of bundle things together. First... In the inside layer, we have by Mochi by Purple Rain, we have a kind of short sleeve, cap sleeve-ish, I don't know what you call this particular sleeve, with this pattern front and then a cotton back, so I guess you'd call this a mixed material top. So that's very pretty, I like that. And then we have this navy cardigan that goes over it, Chris and Carol. And it's a very lightweight cardigan, which again is more seasonally appropriate. And does it have pockets? No pockets on this one. This is, and what is the front? It's kind of a straight front, maybe even, it looks like kind of a straight front here. So exciting. Let's get that. Can't wait to get that on. And then a pair of jeans. And it's always exciting to get a pair of jeans because it's like, Jeans alone could easily make up the cost of this box. Ooh, okay. Distressed. I like that. This is a brand I have never tried. Velvet Heart Premium Denim. This is, this is the Elsie Mid-Rice Skinny Ankle. And it's got, you know, plenty of distressing on it. And it's ankle, so hopefully it should be a good length. So, okay. Cute, cute. All right. So four pieces for $67. That's exciting. So let's go ahead and get these pieces on and hopefully they fit. Okay, so I have three of the four pieces on now. So let's kind of start here at the top. 
The cardigan is nice. It is lightweight. It's kind of got the longer drape front here. And again, a good lightweight feel fits pretty well. Not like a, a, a very snug one, but definitely not oversized. So I like it. I can't say I'm like super excited because I already have navy cardigans so i don't know that i needed this but it's a great deal and as i was putting this on was really thinking okay these are tag on items i actually could be just selling whatever i don't want to keep and that even makes it more worthwhile so the tank here the kind of cap sleeve i guess i'll take the cardigan off the cap sleeve top here I like the color variety of it. It does feel a bit big on me, just overall feels big, but it's not too bad. It's just not the greatest. And again, this might be one that I look into selling. Here it is all the way around. This one I'd really like to get your guys' opinions. What do you think? Does it look too big? What do you think of the pattern? Here's a look at that. So I don't know, it's okay, it's just okay. The jeans, okay, the jeans are a good fit. I only had to do a single row of the bottom. They had an unusually small ankle opening. It's like I really had to like put a little effort to get it over my heel, which is not the norm for me, but makes kind of a roll lay nice and flat. So I'm not mad at that. It's cute, I like the wash of it. So I like these a lot. The only thing is that they're just they're a bit big here on the waist, so I would belt these up, but who cares? For the deal, I am very, very happy to have these, so I'm not mad at that at all. Let's get on the plaid shirt now. Here is the plaid shirt. I think it is cute. Let me roll this up. It's kind of laying weird. It feels like a, a nice transition type piece with it, the shorter arm length and it's kind of a thinner item and could look cute with maybe a, a coral cardigan on or something like that to give it more of a brightness springiness so i am kind of doing a little front tuck here here it is untucked so i think it's cute i could see myself wearing this so i do like having some casual flannels to wear around like this so i don't know what do you guys think all right, so let's do a quick recap on things and I'll give you guys what kind of the original prices of these items were. Let's do this. Well, I did not expect to be filming this on a different day than the intro and try on. Um, I got a call while I was, I've, I've filmed this and a trunk cob and a stitch fix that are going to be posted later this week. All three of them at once on Sunday. It is now Monday. Uh, Sunday I was about to do the try on for my stitch fix video. I had already filmed my Natalie attired and went and checked my phone which was out in the living room and I always keep it on silent because I just have grown to hate the sound of notifications and I went and checked my phone and saw I had a call from my parents that I had missed with a voicemail and I knew my grandma was not doing well when I saw that and I knew exactly what that call was and so called my dad back and my grandma which was my mom's mom had passed and uh, mom couldn't make the call so dad had to and that was uh, hard. No, she's 96. She was 96, and I think she was. She loved the Lord, and I am happy for her. Actually, you know, I'm happy for her that she gets to go home and be with Christ, and just sad for the rest of us. So, um, gosh, don't cry. Um, Anyways, so I'm still kind of emotionally dealing with it and obviously I just was not in a place to finish filming yesterday, so I'm back at it today and love my grandma, you know, mourning the loss of her, but happy that she's free, happy that she's home. So anyways, let's get back to it. I want to give you guys the prices of things as they were original, final thoughts, things like that. So let's go ahead and get into it. 
first we have by Always and Forever. This is the long sleeve placket top, originally $39. This one I just think is a kind of a cute casual at home shirt. I think this actually be really cute with some light colored jeans or even white jeans, something like that. So I, I think this is cute. I think I'll get some use out of it. I probably wouldn't have bought it at $39. I don't know that I loved it that much. But now that I have it, I will wear it. Then we have, this is by Chris and Carol. And this is a long sleeve open front cardigan. Originally $39 as well. So I, I liked it. It's a great feel. It's a great fit. I, again, would not have bought it for myself just because I already have some navy cardigans. So I will actually be trying to sell this, which will actually probably work out well as far as kind of the affordability of all of this is I might make a little money off of selling this. So, and then we have the sleeveless top by Mochi and also $39. And again, I think for me, I'd, I'd really like your guys' opinion on this one, but to me, this is probably another one that I'm going to put in the sell category, but yeah, I could probably be convinced otherwise if you guys really love it, but I just, I don't think it was a great fit, and I just, the color pattern was not my favorite. And then my favorite piece of the box was by the Velvet Heart Denim. This is the LC Midrise Skinny Ankle Pants, normally $69. And it was, I'd say, a pretty good fit, and but also a really, really great deal. And I'm excited to try a new brand of denim that I haven't tried before. So this is actually a normally $186 box that again I got for $67 which was the $57 for the collection plus $10 shipping. So what do you guys think? Now I'll, I'll admit that I don't like this one as much as I liked the last one. Again watch that one if you haven't but that being said it's still a great deal hopefully i'll be able to sell some of these pieces which makes it even greater of a deal i'm really glad i tried it and there's a chance that i might do a third one before they stop doing this which i believe is mid-april so i might do a third one i don't know this one kind of made me question if i want to do a third one or not what do you guys think give me your thoughts you guys are the best. I love you. I will hopefully see you in the next video. By the way, my name is Jen and I do all sorts of videos on fashion, mostly unboxing of style boxes. So if you like that, please subscribe. If you are not a, if you like this, I go like this, subscribe. If, if you like this video, give it a like. If you're not subscribed, then please subscribe. And if you are subscribed, then Give yourself, uh, hit that notification button so you get notified every time I post. That would be amazing. Thank you guys so much and we'll see you in the next video. All right, bye.